enjoyed uh, watching that. And what a start for Leeds United right from the off. Yeah, um, they've actually both started really, really well, uh, flying. Uh, but Leeds, you know, they've got so much energy and they're going to be positive. They're going to be going forward and running forward. And, you know, uh, they, are, they are what they are and they don't change. It's so positive. First goal, uh, it, it, it is, a, it is a, an attack from, from Chelsea. Gets cleared here to Phillips. And you know what they are all about. You're going to have a runner going, going, going forward. And it is a brilliant pass from uh, Phillips. But if you look here, Zuma, his recovery run is poor. Because his recovery run should have been the other side. And also... Mendy should do better, the goalkeeper. Take nothing away from Leeds. Great pass from Phillips. And who is there? Bamford. And how crazy that is, you know? Against this old team where he's never played for. Um, his first chance and put it in the back of the net. And deservedly. A sweet moment for him. Uh, to get his eighth Premier League goal of the season. Mm. It is, and it's great when the goalkeeper makes up your mind. You know, when he comes steaming out like that, then well, thanks very much, you know. Otherwise, I would have had to choose a, an option, take a touch, you know, where am I going to put it? But when Mendy just runs out, then it's, uh, it makes his mind up. Yeah. Now, I said before the game, it could be a tale of two strikers. Bamford, of course, was one. Olivier Giroud was obviously the other. But he's, he's all round play. He's all mm. round confidence levels at the moment. Yeah, we've been watching him carefully. And, and this is a little bit like the, the Firmino stroke Salah at Liverpool, you know. A, 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 a sort of a soft nine, let's say, that, that drops off and then leaves others to run in behind. We also spoke about at the start of the, the programme tonight is in terms of Cavani and his desire to get in front and into the near post situations. It's exactly what Giroud's done twice there. The second occasion, I mean, Werner misses an absolute sit of it. It's all round play. Watch him now closing down, closing from the front. So you've had a bit of everything, hold up play, closing down, goals, near post runs, and it's another near post run really, the theme of the day, look at him, he gets the wrong side because he knows where he wants and then he just nips in, into that front post area. Um, you know, nobody gives him really the credit because he's a big centre forward that's not got loads of pace. No one gives him any credit for, for his movement, but he's very, very subtle in the box as Olivier Giroud. He showed that in midweek with four goals, and he's really been the star man for Chelsea today. And he has now scored in six Premier League games running when he has started in his last six Premier League starts, and that is not easy to do. Have you any idea the last Chelsea player to do that, Jimmy? <laughs> <laughs> I can mention you one, one or two, I think. The last person to do it, 2001, Drogba. Oh, then it must be Hasselbank, yeah. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> No, I didn't know, honestly, I, I didn't know. You, but you just got the 23 goals that season in the Premier just, League. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> Luckily, he was not in the country. <laughs> no, but he's been, he's been absolutely magnificent. Um, and what he has, we've been talking about movements, about strikers and, you know, Cavani and stuff. He's one of them as well. His movement is really, really good. And he doesn't get the credit. It's, it's crazy that he is not the first one on that sheet. You know, in that form that he is in, you know, sometimes for a striker, it is one of those things. Whatever you hit, it's going to go into the goal. And he's playing with that kind of confidence. But it is quality goals that he's scoring. It's not like lucky ones. It's quality. It's calculated. And that is so impressive. Just quickly, we saw in that run there, um, Timo Werner. Yeah. Not quite finished one off. I mean, what's your reading of that? Well do anything with that you can either sort of let it hit your thigh move into it just look just like kill it into the goal basically stud it but he's tried to almost go with the side of his foot and it's he's just mistimed it simple as that i mean oh i think andy townsend <laughs> mentioned in tra in, in uh, commentary that he probably will never ever miss a chance like that again in his whole career his whole life maybe I mean, it's an absolute sitter. It's going to go on all the Christmas videos, Howlers of the Year. OK, 